one and all! Quante95 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Cave Story. In the last episode, we defeated Balrog, one of the main antagonists of this game, and in this episode, we will teleport ourselves to the Egg Corridor. What adventures await us in this place? Let's find out! The Egg Corridor! Ooh, another life capsule. But first, let's talk to this guy. I'd watch out if I were you. That thing, white, that white thing at the bottom. One touch and pow, it's over. Yes, that white guy at the bottom. Well, he's full of doom, destruction, and sadness. And one touch of him will be the end of us. But not as long as we stock up on these life capsules. Then the end of us will never come. That way we'll never meet our doom, but we can cause destruction and sadness among these little elephant-like creatures. Boom! Aw, oh, no eggs. We'll bump you, sir. Yes. EXP for the win, and we're gonna level up pretty soon here. Let's get a level 3. Soon, soon enough, we're just gonna be able to start killing things in one hit. That's how strong this thing will be. And we level up! See, that thing didn't even stand a chance. We just really ended his life right then and there. Ooh. So if I let him take damage from that, I'll land it right on top of him. One of the things I forgot to mention in the last episode is that you can actually level down by taking damage. See how I got hit right there? Yeah, and then the meter actually went down. So, that's something to watch out for if you're gonna play this game. There you are, monster. I'm not afraid of you. Wow! Yeah, what's that? You wanna bring it? Go ahead and try. Even my brother's never beaten me. Crash. Generic crashing noise. Who are you? Erk. Erk, erk, make take. Erk, erk. And we watch her get taken away. Yet again, we just watch someone get taken away to their doom or demise. I'm getting really tired of that happening. That's all the character does is just sit there and watch someone when they're being taken away. You need to take evasive action, unknown character. Ho oh ho! A soldier from the surface. Didn't expect to see you here. Where are the others? What's that? Your memory's gone. <laughs> well, we seem to be on solid ground, sir, so I don't see what's so funny about that. And what does he mean by the others? There's just too much in that. Life capsule. Max health increased by four. Yes. We're gonna need as much of those as possible. Cause this game starts to be a dick later on. Absolutely love the music in this game. You'll probably mention it in the last episode, but I'm gonna keep on mentioning it, because that's just how awesome it is. And it's to make mention multiple times. That's just how great this game is. It's absolutely free, so go download it in the description right now. Oh, wait, there's an opening right there. We can actually go inside these numbered eggs right here. And they will take us to important places and give us very important treasures. Such as this. The ID card. What importance does this hold? We'll see about this later. Yep, and there- Oh, no! No! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, doom, destruction, and sadness has been laid upon us. Oh. Good God, man. I have to do all that over. No! Uh, I'm gonna have to edit that out. Thinking we're in the same spot that I died in, but... Yeah, that was horrible. I had to do all that over, get the life capsule and everything again. So... I think we're at the point where I died, so I guess I can start talking again. 
Yes, we are. I'm just gonna save right here. Just in case anything stupid happens again. Gosh, that sucks so <laughs> bad. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I already died in the second video. Anyway, let's get another treasure. And another very important item. The missile launcher. This is gonna be our second weapon in this game. The missile launcher is a powerful weapon, but its ammo is limited. You can only replenish your stockpile with items dropped by enemies, which is why I only recommend using this item on bosses. Just because it's more convenient that way, and you won't have to worry about losing a bunch of ammo and crap like that. You find a note. With the shield up, I can't get to number zero's room. I think one of these terminals ought to be able to lower the shield. Hmm. Wonder what that means. Yeah, I think I'm still freaking traumatized because I died. Those things, man, make me so angry. <laughs> Gosh, I, I do not want to get hit by one of those again. So, oh my god. I'm just gonna wait for him to go back. I'm not taking any chances. Ooh, wish I could kill it. Oh, no. Hurry up. Oh, oh there he is. Numbers one. Egg number one. Inserted ID card. Shield lowered. So that's what they meant by shield, but what effects did that have? Well, it looks like we can progress to this area. Wait, it's that man bear rabbit! Man bear rabbit! No one may touch the master's precious eggs! Whoa! That punching thing? Yeah, it's not gonna work on us. You're too slow! Sonic. Oh, Fustro Dog. Well, that was a Mimigo? They have that sort of power? Defeated Igor. Let's check him out. Well, well, we can't check him out. He's just dead. It won't open. Let's try this one. Egg number zero. There's that girl. Ugh. Oh. Whoa! Hey, I'm not dead yet. You're gonna eat it next time. Huh? I got creamed by that monster. Did you save me? I sure did. I don't need your help. Well, thank you. I saved your life, and now you're just gonna do that? Oh. Look, I think it's number zero. This egg could be our one-way ticket off this island. Egg condition normal. That's what I like to hear. Hmm. A password. Looks like you need a password to hatch this egg. Well, crud! If only my brother were here, he'd set things straight. Alright, it looks like I'm done here for now. Are you from around here? Doesn't look like it doesn't. The words on your cap there. That's not a language that they have on this island. Did you get lost? That's okay. I'll let you come with me. We'll get off this dump together. In return, you're gonna help me. Well, okay. <laughs> Sky Dragon egg number zero. Hatching preparations complete. Input password. So she wants us to help us. Or help her. And we just met her. I guess she does want us to help her. Even though she clearly just said she didn't need our help. What a hypocrite. Oh, save. Mr. Yeah. There we go. Now we're gonna need to go all the way to the end. And I don't think I necessarily need to show myself going to the end, but I might just do that anyway. I might do some grinding on the way back to level up our missiles, even though we didn't use them. And this is the menu screen. It basically just tells you everything about the what item you have. You know, the missile launcher basically just tells us 
it, you know, the most basic gun that bears the mark of Polaris, whatever that means. Wide range and powerful damage, however, it's some ammunition is limited. But, yep. And actually, let's just test it out. Yeah. Destroyed that thing in one hit. Normally, they take a bunch of hits. But, yeah. So, those are very effective on bosses. And I don't usually even use those things on bosses, but, you know. If it gets to that point, I'm actually just gonna have to use it. And see, this is the level up version. And it's just a bigger version of the missile. Keep on switching, keep on switching, keep on switching weapons. No! Oh my god! Oh, okay. I'm not gonna be able to get up there. Oh, I'm just gonna have to go. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Okay. Oh. Gosh, that thing is so nerve wracking, man. Just knowing that it does one hit kill. Uh, what? One hit kill things this early in the game. Not even the boss is a one hit kill. And they just make this thing you want to hit kill. Oh. And it has the, mo the most basic design ever, and it just kills you. Yeah. Yeah, silence. Awkward silence at that. I think we should get the level 3. Ah, oh, no EXP. Come on, I want to get this thing to level 3 before we get out of here. And yeah, and it fires 3 missiles at a time. I'm still gonna level up it more, just so in case we get hit. But yep, so that does it for our weapons. So we should be set for the next- oh my god, I <laughs> just abused the weapons there. But we should be set for the next area. Oh, uh, it's at max, but the Polar Star isn't at max anymore because I got hit so much. Let's head on back. Yes. Connecting the network. Logged on. Executing chat algorithm. Kazuma, are you there? Are you okay? Sue, is it really you? It's me, Sue Sakamoto. You got away too then. Where are you right now? I found some dragon eggs. Is mom with you? The door's stuck and I can't get out. I'm still in this shelter short of place. The sector code is Grass Town. See if you can run the scan it on it from there. Also, mom's not here. I think she still might be with the doctor. Do any of the dragons look immediately hatchable? At least one of them does, but it's locked up with a password. Can you do anything about that? Receiving information from user Kazuma. Complete. Location Grass Town Structured Day. Scanning for operation of teleporters. Preparing for connection to teleporter Grass Town. Well, okay, I'm coming to help you. Just wait right there. Gotcha. Oh, by the way, I could really use user Sue disconnected. When's that other boy getting here? You're back. You, we have I been waiting for you, Squidward. Yeah, what now? I'm kind of busy. Torco's been kidnapped by the doctor's henchmen. What? And we're holding you responsible. Oh no! Let me go! Oh no! Huh? What's up, Pointy? Welcome back! Sue's back. She's locked up in the cage outside. When the Dr. Flunkies come, we're gonna get Toriko back. In exchange for Sue, you see. It's not very nice, I know, but Toriko is one of us. That's, the, that's what you get when you act alone. Was it Sue one of you? I mean, she looks exactly like you. Let me out this instant. Hold your tongue. You're the reason Torko got kidnapped. Our only chance is to turn you over to them 
and hope for the best. You creep-eyed freak. If we don't get Torco back safely, I swear I'll tell you limb from limb. A little brutal. Let's go up there and negotiate. This is the fate of all who disturb the Erdor of our village. what that just says we're gonna have to go to the next area which is grass town and we can access it through that teleporter just as we did the egg core but with that with the first area being done and all i think we're gonna end this video off right here so until next time guys i'm quantum 95 and i'll see you guys in the next one